Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we are playing Belgium in Victoria 2. We are currently... well, we just sphered Japan. That's nice. We're working on the Netherlands next. We have Sweden in our pocket, Spain and Portugal as well, which is nice because they're numbers 10, 12, and 13. Uh, Italy is number 9, but I'm not really going to worry about them. They should bump up to number 8 as soon as Bavaria does something dumb. I don't know. I don't know why they're number 9 and not number 8, but they are. Uh, things are looking pretty good. Portugal is not really getting uppity. We're not going to call them into any wars. And Spain, same sort of thing. I don't want them to accidentally become a great power and break free of our sphere. And uh, in a month or two, we're going to be declaring war on China because they deserve it. That's right. We're letting our infamy drop as fast as possible so that we'll be able to demand stuff from them in this war. And of course, if they accidentally have a rebel problem and they wind up succumbing to reactionaries and stopping their westernization progress, all the better. Bremen is bankrupt. Oh, sad day. Okay, June is upon us. It is time for war. Well, we could wait until July. Right? Yeah, let's wait until July. We'll get one more month of infamy reduction. Oh, election time. Goody. <laughs> okay, July. Here we go. Oh, we have to pick a province, don't we? Well, they only have a few. Oh, no, they have a lot. What the hell? When did they get all these? Oh, God. Formosa counts? Really? And Port Arthur, one, one county province? Really? And Hong Kong counts. So I take that back. They had three unexpected regions here. I did not expect them to have these three. I knew about the rest. Well, let's see what we got. What's available? Nanyang. Oh, wow. Huge populations. Nothing really new, though. It's just tea and timber. What about down here? Hanyang. It's just tea. In fact, it's all tea. Okay. Oh, no. And iron. Okay. Huizo. Tea, tea, wood, and tea. Wenzo, tea, wood, silk, 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 wood, <laughs> wood, and tea. I guess it doesn't really matter which one we go for. We'll just go for all the things, right? This is the only one we can't take right now. It's their capital. So that's fine. They can keep their capital. Where we got the best pop? We got what? Three million, four million, four and a half, and about five point seven million. Let's see, three and a half, five and a half, six and a quarter, eight and a half million in that one. Ooh, that's a nice one. Eight and a half million. Uh, two hundred k, maybe one million, one and a half, two million, two point two. That's a very low pop one. Let's see, 1.28, 1.28, that's 2.5, 3.5, 4.5, okay, not bad. Alright, I remember this one was a small pop, yeah, just a few million. Alright, we'll go for the, the high pop one. Huizu! Huizu! Huizu, the top one, there you go. 28 war score, who wants to join me? Well, I'm not going to call everyone. Uh, we will call, selectively, the USA. Because why not? Go USA! We'll call Austria. Go Austria! We'll call... I don't know. Not Spain, Portugal. Not Sweden. Mm, who's weak? Egypt! Call Egypt! Go Egypt! Go Siam! 
invade their shit, Siam. And Japan. All right, Japan. Oh, we can't. We're not allied with Japan. Shit. Ugh. Oh, well. So. Go. Whoa, was that 104,000? I didn't realize I had that many units there. Go over there, and then go down there. Just kill some people. Now we're attacking for Huizu, which is down here. So we should send some troops to that region. And the rest of them can just kill units. Kill units. Kill units, I said. Ooh, protectionism, yes. Ooh, prestige. I like prestige. Or prestigy, whatever you want to call it. Okay, kill them and come back. Kill them and come back. Eh, might as well invade a little bit. Hey, we can do dye factories now. Nice. Split in half and just siege everything. What are they going to do about it? Exactly. What are you going to do about it, China? Stop hitting yourself. Split in half. Siege all the things. Split in half. And there's not much left to fight. Fight, 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 fight. There's nothing left to fight. I mean, there might be some armies somewhere. Yeah, like right there. But we're already going to attack them. Sorry. Yep. Oh, look, he wants peace. <laughs> white peace. I don't know. We're already winning by 26, and he wants a white peace. Are you kidding me? I think the answer to that is no. In fact, I'm pretty sure the answer to that is no. Hey, let's go fight their navy. Sounds like fun. And we destroyed the navy. Great. And the USA dropped off some units. Loads. No, you can't have white peace. Why do you keep asking for white peace? It's like you think I'm colorblind and I don't know what you mean. Oh, look, white peace. I don't think so. Oh, we've been discredited in the Netherlands. Oh. Oh, that, that, that burns. Really, it sucks. Since we went from, what, neutral to discredited. Wow. That hurts. Ooh, anti-military. Yes, please. It's actually a little bit hard to tell which color is which, because the colors are similar enough that when they're shaded, like 
they're shaded because of fog of war or whatever. It's hard to tell who's who's owns what sometimes. Okay. More organization. Yes, please. China's just want, they just want to check and see if we want white piece right now. Yeah, you're right. They just, they're curious. Would you guys like a white piece? We could offer you a nice white piece. What do you think? Ooh. Oh, I don't know. That's tempting. But I did turn you down the last 30,000 times, so uh, I'm going to say no. Sorry. Oh, look, white piece. Nope. Oh, well. Uh, protectionism, yes. And yeah, let's invade a little more. Who is this? This is King High. Partially westernized. Yeah, how can we stop them from being um How can we stop how can we kick them out of the westernization process? Because they've already started it. And I don't see any rebels anywhere. I mean, we could just hold on to the war for a long, 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 long time, right? I guess. Hey, the conservatives won. Finally, the conservatives won something. Look at that. Holstein goes bankrupt. Everyone's going bankrupt. Silly Germany. Colonial incident. Oh, on France. Ooh, placing the sun on France. Yeah, why not? I'm not going to act on it, but thanks for the offer. Hey, France, how about a hug? Would you like a hug? He needs a hug. France needs a hug. How did France fall below Austria? Oh, wow, Austria has really industrialized. Whoa. Nice job, Austria. Seriously, that's pretty good. A little better than us. A little better. Joining is impossible. I'm not sure why. Although I think we don't have an alliance yet. That might be why. No alliance. No joining. Oh, he's actually wanting, wanting to give it to me now. Give it to me, baby. Okay, well, at least he's not offering a white piece anymore. Ah. Uh, I think we just have to wait. I'll let him collapse a little bit. But without without rebels, I don't think we're going to be able to get him to stop westernizing. That's the problem. He's westernizing. I want him to stop. Oh, the USA is trying to demand something from these idiots. Yeah, enjoy that. Lose consciousness. Good. shit is anymore.
Ooh. Ooh. Socialist. Ouch. Oh. Burn the Summer Palace. Nope. There's just no reason. We get three infamy for nothing, really. Balfour Declaration? Revolution and Counter Revolution. Israel gets core. Oh, because I control Egypt. Oh, that's hilarious. Why would we even bother with that, though? <laughs> Let's make our vassals weaker. That's a good plan. It's a great plan. If you're truly awesome, you don't need a strong vassal. Or something like that. Yeah, I still don't see any rebels. Rebels? Are you a rebel? No. I don't see rebels anywhere. Discredited in the Netherlands. <sighs> of course it was. What did they say about us this time, Netherlands? Oh, they're pulling within 90 points. They're getting close. Time to beat up some armies. Beat them up. USA is trying to get this chunk right here. <laughs> Go for it, bro. Let's see, what do we have? 61% war score. Why don't we add to the war goal uh, this region, Nanyang. Five infamy. <gasps> no. And what about this one? Yeah, this one has some decent pop. We'll take Han Yang as well. We'll go nuts. He's gone mad. Not really. I would just like some land, please. Please, could I have some land? All I ask is for a little land. A place to put my feet up. <gasps> Rebels. Mongolian reactionaries. It's not what I want. I want Chinese reactionaries. God damn it. Ooh, logistics. Okay. Logistics. Actually, why don't we get uh, some better steamers? Yes. Pre-dreadnoughts. Yes. And cruisers. Yes. Where the hell is this? Jeki Ju... Yaki Ju Chuglang. No, I've never heard of that before. And I probably never will again.
consciousness or liberal? We'll take the liberal. And what was the last one I wanted? Han Yang, right. Han Yang, baby. Yeah. I'm sure they'll give me all that stuff. Ooh, fuel refinery. Nice. That'll go well with the oil, if we can get some freaking oil. Please, can I have oil? No, I don't want you to give anything to the USA. Fuck them. They didn't earn it. Shit's mine, dog. But yeah, they have no military. I would love to see some Chinese reactionaries. It says they still have military power. Does anyone know why China still has military power? They have one brigade and two ships and 43 war exhaustion. Holy crap. I think that's good enough. Why don't we take our demands and get out? Because with all that war exhaustion, they're just toast. They're toast. There goes the Navy, and their last soldier is now dead. Okay. Yeah, they're fucked. No military, tons of war exhaustion. I think that's enough. I think, um... You think it's a good time to let them off the hook? What do you guys say? We can take our three regions, get out, and hopefully those reactionaries will come up. With 48% war exhaustion. Anyone? You guys are talking about Australian ISPs. <laughs> siege them more? We've already sieged them. They have no provinces that aren't sieged. They have no provinces that aren't sieged. <laughs> Everything is sieged. Yeah, I was going to say, we can just peace out. I think we should be fine here. Oh, beautiful. And the USA is going to be a little upset we didn't give anything to them, but... Screw you, USA. Screw you! Let's get relations back up. Everybody needs relations. Relations. Britain especially needs relations. Wow, are they, they're they just angry little Brits. But yeah, next time we're going to go for Fenyang. And Wenzo and Lizo, but I'm really hoping with that massive war exhaustion that they'll have huge revolts. They have n they have no prestige, no factories, and no military. They should just fall over and die. I mean, that's I'm expecting them to just fall over and die. I'm hoping they will just fall over and die. In the meantime, new forts and railroads for everyone. Lovely. Look, everyone, everyone in China, one of you's gonna go there, 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 here, there, here, here, here. Wow, so many armies. So very many 
armies cannot contain... Oh, shit. Whatever. I fucked that up. The first to the poll! Yes! Oh, yes. Go to the poll. Please. The stripper poll. What is it? Uh... Um? Oh! What? Oh, I can make them friendly. Can do. Now, how long is our truce? 1901. Yeah, it's six years. So I thought it was supposed to be five-year truce, but it's actually six-year truce. Interesting. And build me some more units. Give me... Sure. And... Yes. And soon we will be building... Airplanes and tanks and shit. Soon. But not yet. Oh my god, so many units. So many units! <laughs> okay, one of you can stay, one of you can go, another one can go, and another one can go. You guys are still coming back. Okay. Okay, and you... Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Look, it's fine. Relax. Keep your feet up. <sighs> so how are they doing? They still have huge war exhaustion and no units. But I don't see any rebellions. You guys need to have some rebels. Yo. Please. Come on, I saw Mongolian reactionaries. I want to see some Chinese reactionaries. Damn it. But we do need to end our episode here, so thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen, you have been you. Come back next time where we will continue to build massive, massive armies and watch the world burn. I'll see you then. Have a good day.